A lot of people ask the difference between high chirp and low chirp and what they do. Your high chirp transducers are what most people use and they're great in the shallower sort of fishing situation. They do work out deeper, but what you lose is the detail and that's where the low chirp transducer comes into its own. And even in 150 odd meters of water, they work so well, but here we are in 350. We've got low chirp running on this side. We've got high chirp running on this side. Yes, they're both marking the bottom, but the high chirp is losing the detail. We've just got bottom there, but on the low, you can clearly see we've got much more bottom detail. There's some feed layer coming through here, some bait and stuff like that. I'm actually running less gain on the high, low chirp than I am on the high chirp, and I've got my color brought back because this is a more powerful transducer and it's picking up that fine detail in the deeper water. So that is the reason, guys, that you wanna have the low chirp transducer if you're fishing in the deep water. For general fishing, your high chirp is absolutely dynamite, but when you get out here, get yourself one of those.